you, I think, you'll have to uh, uh, elaborate for me, but I think you're responsible for bringing um, graduate programs to this college, certainly the doctoral program. You, you mm -hmm. started that, correct? We had a master's program okay. already. And, uh, but we didn't have a professional master's program. Mm -hmm. and, and in fact, I guess we still don't in a way. We started one this year. Yeah, but, but yeah it, it's, we reinstated it's very professional. Yeah. To do because uh, of the system of the, of the university sort of worked against us a little bit. Mm -hmm. We weren't in charge of the graduate program. We were completely in charge of the undergraduate program. But the there's a graduate division at the University of Florida. Oh, Maybe that's, I didn't you don't know have that, that problem. There's there. a division, but we're responsible for our own graduate and, uh, programs. We, I mean, we're responsible for it, but we have to follow the rules mm -hmm. that they lay down. Mm -hmm. And uh, they wanted everything to be theoretical from the graduate level. Mm -hmm. And we wanted to start a professional program for mm -hmm. those students who couldn't take undergraduate and work around for undergraduate. Mm -hmm. But uh, the PhD program uh, we did start when I was dean. And I, I credit Kurt Kent largely for mm -hmm. that. Uh, one of our faculty members, graduate faculty members, who mm -hmm. really did all the research, mm -hmm. outlined everything, and got that through. And, you and now he it's deserves one of the, the credit in the nation. But, uh, but actually, we did that because students, which is a big state now, the third largest mm -hmm. state and population in the country, and our students who wanted to be teachers at the university level and sometimes high school level, we're having to go out of state to get the graduate level courses at right. the PhD level. Yeah. <laughs> we felt we weren't serving the state properly and we started the PhD program which also enhanced our reputation. And today, at, at this point in time, we we have about 75 doctoral mm -hmm. students. Amazing. Yeah, it makes us one of the largest programs in the oh. nation. So um, that was um, one of your most significant moves. So we're one of the largest programs, in, I think we're the second largest in terms of enrollment in the country. You know, yeah. it, it really, it's how it's counted. Mm -hmm. um, you know, the other schools are, are taking that mantle, but we're definitely among the top mm -hmm. three largest mm -hmm. uh, colleges in the nation.